going to show you another how to check your gungeon and rear frame bearing setup so all your 9000 series tractors have this little piece of metal on it so we use it for a tool so your gap on your your bearing gap on your gungeon and rear frame should be consistent and we have found that this little tool here which is not authorized by your John Deere dealer but if you can stick that in typically the bearings loose or the bearing you know there's some there's some gap in there some play in it so and some of these are a little bit just from paint some of these are just a little bit thicker than the others so even if it was to go in there, as long as everything's consistent, and you'll be able to see that, that's how we check them. So you can do the same thing, and if you're buying a used one, and you wanna know whether you're gonna have to put bearings in it or not, that's how we do it right there. So whether you're buying a tractor, whether you're needing to replace one or not, one last thing, um, to know if you've got the bearing style gungeon. One, it's gonna have three nipples, grease nipples on the pin. You've got a grease fitting here, here, and here. And then you've got a duplicate on the other side. The pin diameter is something that the OEM really just makes difficult. We've solved that. We just make them we can solve that with bushings so no need to go into the details there but gungeon spindle rear frame 9000 series tractors that's how you check it